Hi, I'm Alvin, and here is what explainable AI fails to explain, and how we fix that. Here's a picture. What animal is this? Our neural network predicts bird. Hmm, do you agree? We need an explanation. Fortunately, explainable AI offers two popular tools. Explainable AI tool number one. Saliency maps highlight pixels the neural network used. Consider two neural networks. Neural network number one classifies the bird correctly, and its saliency map highlights the bird, so looks good. Neural network number two looks at the same pixels, but it gets the bird species wrong. Why? How? We can't tell. Saliency maps fail to explain how the model makes decisions. The model is accurate, but uninterpretable. So let's try another tool. Explainable AI tool number two. Decision trees break down predictions into steps. For example, here's a decision tree. Instead of only predicting cat, this model makes intermediate decisions we can understand. However, decision trees are 40% less accurate than neural networks. In other words, decision trees fail to explain accurate computer vision models. Interpretable, but inaccurate. To solve this problem, we build neural back decision trees, which improve accuracy, interpretability, and generalization. We preserve high-level interpretability by imposing a structure of decisions. We then use neural networks for low-level decisions. For our furry friend, we see that MBDT decides on bird. Consider how certain each decision is, over 95% certainty in most cases, except when the model decides between dog and bird. Now we understand the model's decision process. Our MBDTs are more accurate than other neural network and decision tree hybrids by up to 15%. Our MBDTs are also more accurate than the original neural networks by 1%. Finally, MBDTs outgeneralize the original neural networks by up to 16%. We conduct a human study where participants classify super blurry images into one of 10 classes. By the way, this is a frog. We then repeat the study, except the second time, participants are given model predictions and explanations. Users may agree with MBDT, agree with the neural network, explain by a saliency map, or ignore both. Of 600 responses, participants trust and agree with MBDT twice as often as the original neural network. Additionally, even though MBDT was wrong 70% of the time, Human classification performance improved by 15% when they were given model predictions and explanations. To learn more, visit our website. To get started, pip install MBDT. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Check out our website for the technical version of this talk.